Yeah, just um, I'm, I'm worried about this time in American history. You know, we, we have uh, an administration that made it clear from the day of the inauguration that we were not going to impose our standards on other or our, our uh, values on other countries. And I really believe in the strategic values of the United States as being perhaps for many of the people of the world and many of the fragile states in the world the last best hope for their rescue. We have to stand up for those. And when we cut back the, the uh, budget of the State Department and we cut the, the budget of the USAID, when we vilify publicly that foreign assistance is in fact a giveaway program, all of those things in, in the confluence or in the accumulation work to our detriment. As Mark said, as Michelle said, this is about communications. We have to communicate that this is not just good for America, it's good for humankind. Uh, the strength of the United States is not 10 strike carrier strike groups. The strength of the United States is in the values that we can project. It's in our diplomats every single day that are in our embassies that represent the United States of America. It's in our aid and development workers who are risking their lives every single day uh, out in, the, uh, in those developing countries trying to make a difference in their lives. We've got to tell that story and we've got to stand up for the values of the United States and there can be no uh, ambiguity in the minds of the people around the world about what we stand for and what we are prepared to do to help humankind. And as long as we're able to tell that story, I think that we have a, a, a prospect of being successful in these areas. Okay. Thanks for watching. Be sure to like and subscribe for more videos from Brookings.